Welcome back. We're going into more of The Sims 3 Free Folk. Today we're going to be making Faye and Galen to join our family. I haven't actually tested the game to see if I can play with this many characters, Ayaka. but I'm going to be optimistic with it. I think we can make it work somehow. If not, we can always kick a couple people out. The tank can go live across the street or something. I'm going to be making Faye first. I don't know why, but when you make a lady muscular, suddenly her boobs get very pointy. Look at that. I don't... How am I supposed to fix that? I have some actual boob mods that I'm going to try to fix this with, but... Oh. I think that's actually making it worse. Um, yeah, yeah, we don't want that. I don't, I don't know what to do. I think she really should be muscular, but she needs boobs. And that's, that's just scary. That's like alien boobs. I don't know. I'm gonna mess with it some more. See if we can get it workable. At the very least, it, you know, it might even just be the shirt. We'll see. I'm going to fix this. I'm kind of stuck on hair for her. It's like, I like this one. I, th I actually think this one looks really cute, but that's not really fey hair. And this one's a little too emo. Uh, that one might work, actually. I was also, I was looking at, uh, where was it? And this one too, but... Yeah, I think that's a little too girly as well. I think I'm gonna go with... No, 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 not that one. This one. Yeah, I think that works. I think that looks good. We're going to try to make her look really sporty. I, she's not the type to running around in heels and dresses and pretty little frills like some of the other girls in the house. So, yeah, not leopard skin. I think we're just gonna go with the plain shirt. That looks good. I'm going to predict now that she's gonna be best friends with Hal. I think they're just going to just sit around and work out together, talk about sports and other things. And she might get along good with Gwen as well. I don't know. She might just like everybody. Okay, I think she looks pretty good. Uh, she's a little plain, but I don't think Faye really needs a lot of frills or special things. So, we're gonna move on to Galen. Now Galen could use some frills and things, I think. He would be one to have the best outfits of the bunch. This game lived forever. Oh no no no, that's not Kaylin. We have to work a little magic here. I don't know, he looks vaguely Galen-ish, but I don't know, there's something still, I can't... I can't get that Galen look yet. This is going to take a while, isn't it? Galen, you're always a problem. Why are you always a problem? Uh, I don't know. I, I think we're getting there. But it's just... There's something about him. We need... We need more something. We need more of a smug look about him. Only Galen could pull off a suit like this. Especially with the pink. He's the only one. Could you imagine, like, Morty in something like this? Or math? No. That wouldn't work. Only game. All things considered, I think they came out all right. All right, let's get them in. No, no, stop it. Oh yeah, that looks way better, doesn't it? Everybody's got some room. We got a lake in the back too. That's so nice. I like it. All right, we're gonna keep that, and we're gonna knock down the other one. I 
Okay, everything looks like it's fine here. Yep, everything carried over to the new house. We just have more room now. So that's... oh no. It looks like Sage was cooking again. It's already gross things in the fridge. Alright, very well, we're going to go ahead and drop Faye and Galen into this madness. There we go. Right. Everybody's here. Yes, Galen. And Faye wants to join a medical career. No, she won't do good in a medical career. We're gonna go and make her an athlete like Cal is. Oh, Kenick, Esther, take it easy. I think they're still just very happy from the last death and- What? Alright, math is just skinny dipping in front of anyone. Everyone. Alright, let's go get them some jobs. Faye, go be an athlete. Yeah, don't worry about him. Aelin, we're gonna make you a policeman. No, no, police station. There you go. This is going to be Faye's room. Oh, no, 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 it's too girly. Um, I don't know where we're going to put Galen yet, though. Um, I guess we have some room over here we can stick another one in. Yeah, we'll go ahead with that. Originally, my thought was to build a little apartment above the bathroom, but yeah, we'll make him his own little prison cell. I think that would work a lot better than living above the bathroom. Oh, it would be pretty convenient. You really had to go. I mean, you're only a couple stairs away. So. Nah, he can walk. He can walk. There we go. Galen's almost looks like a little cabin. It's really, it's really, really cute. Look at that. That's nice. Faze looks more modern than I was going for, but eh, it's still pretty nice. Oh, uh, where's that light? There we go. Put a couple of these in. Yeah. That's not bad. Oh, 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 oh. Stop it! I want the light! Give me this light! There we go. Perfect! Let's look at our prison complex. It actually- it actually doesn't look too bad. You know, it's bad, but it's not too bad. Everything in this house is breaking. We have a sink broken. The hot tub is still broken. It's leaking water everywhere. We need to do something about this. I don't know if any more repairmen will come because we kind of shot the one last time. But, you know, he, he probably had it coming. We don't know what he was doing on his off time. Maybe we can get a zombie repairman out this time. Alright, somebody call and get this. Math disapproves of Faye working out. Just sitting on the toilet. Er, <laughs> toilet. No, the sofa! He's sitting on the sofa, not the toilet. Anzeth and Morty somehow hijacked Gwen's bed. They're sleeping together, but not in either one of their rooms. Now this could be just because I moved everything, I have to reset the bed ownership, but... Where's Gwen? Gwen's in Esther's room. Hal's in Kenick's. Esther's in Anya's. Yeah, something got screwed up when I moved them, so... We're gonna have to figure that out, too. Esther is already yelling at Faye. We don't know why. She's even trying, too. Stop that, Esther. Don't be mean to Faye. She's new. I know she's smelling bad right now, but... Galen has decided that it's a good idea to enthuse about witch hunts to a Tanimaris. Who is a witch? <laughs> oh, 
coaching board though. Ooh. Yeah, they're not even giving each other the time of day right now. So it's not it's not all that different from how they act in game. They try to talk to each other, one yawns, the other gets annoyed. Yeah, that's pretty that's pretty typical actually. Oh, they're gonna hate each other very quickly. Sage has had it with trying to cook. So they're going to go and hang out with their Time Lord friends. They're gonna go to the future and get some replicating technology so they don't have to cook anymore. And nobody can force them to. Go ahead, Sage. Yes. And Sage arrives in the future. Oh, yeah. This guy isn't the best Time Lord. I think I'm just partial because he doesn't have a really long epic scarf. Although we should really get one of those for Sage. Wouldn't they look so cute with one of those big Tom Baker scarves? What is this thing? <gasps> Look at it! It's so cute! I wonder if we can steal this. I want Sage to steal this so we can take this back to the present. Alright, it's a little creepy too. It's cute though, I like it. Sage has successfully stolen this little sprite thing. Yes, I think we got the computer too now. Oh. There you go, Sage. They look like they already know what they're doing with it. This confirms our theories. Sage is actually a Time Lord. We're taking this hoverboard thing too. Apparently whoever lives here doesn't really care that Sage is walking around and taking all of their things. Let's take that one too. And this one. Just take them all, Sage. It's alright, nobody's going to miss them. Sage has decided they've had enough. They're gonna head back now that they can replicate their own food. They don't have to cook anymore. Careful, Sage. Well, they hurt their butt. Alright. Deactivate that before Hal finds it. Hal in the future seems like a really bad idea. So, we're just gonna let Sage hang on to the time traveling technology. There we go. Good job, Sage. You still have all the stuff? Yep. So got lots of technology. Uh, we'll just scatter that around the house, see what kind of trouble people can get up to with it. Look how much Esser and Atanamir hate each other. Look at that, that bar is maxed out. It's only a matter of time before she shoots them. I don't think he gets it either. Nope. I think Antith just doesn't want to sleep on her own because she crawled back into Morty's bed again. I did set the bed parameters, but mm, yeah, she just wants to sleep with Morty now. Alright. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and make Morty a rose garden. I feel like he needs one. And we got the extra room now. 
So let's do that. Are these ones actually roses? They don't really look like roses. Yeah, it says they're roses. Vivid roses. Those are good. Put some of those in too. Rosy roses. Oh, we have those ones already, I guess. What are these ones? There's a lot of roses. Weeds. No, we don't need weeds. Ah, I'll just keep scattering them. There we go. That looks pretty good. Oh, let's get rid of that one. Yeah, that's pretty. That should keep it busy too. There it is. Sage's way out of cooking. Let's try it out, make sure it works. Sage, what do you do? Have dinner. Uh, oh, what should we have? Oh, synthesized cheesesteak. Everybody else is scared of the new technology. That's alright. Sage will show them how it's done. And there's a mad rush for the macaroni and cheese, too. Go ahead, Sage. Pass that line. Ashby Vaga? Krela, Nork. There you go. See? You can bypass all of that cooking. And you can eat whatever you want, Sage. No more making people sick. <laughs> I don't care what anyone else thinks. I think you're hot, says Faye. Well, that's unfay like isn't it? Hal comes over and makes a funny face, and that's apparently romantic to her. I'm gonna have to keep my eye on this. What are you guys doing? Sage. He's like spying on Morty and Anseth. That's creepy. You've been spending way too much time with Hal. That's really, really creepy, Sage. Alright. Surprisingly, Hal and Galen aren't getting along at all. I keep arguing with each other. Let's see. Yeah. Galen can't make any friends. That's very strange. And Esther is here enjoying the arguments. She loves seeing other people upset. Take a look at Anya's new painting. Uh, it's definitely interesting. I can see that her technique's improving. Let's put that on the wall. With all the other ones. Yeah, it's an interesting timeline we're getting now. Gwen! You're so tired! Go to bed! Leave the shuffleboard alone. Nope. And so this is doing what I do on the weekends. Sitting around and playing Dark Souls in your underwear. Apparently she's doing art. Oh no, she's not. There's the death. Faye hasn't made any friends yet. But apparently she wants to get married already. I don't know if there's any real eligible bachelors in the household. We could make her marry Galen or Hal or somebody. I'm not sure what to do with that. I don't know. I think we're gonna let her decide who to marry. We'll just see who she likes the best. And then we'll just let them go from there. Oh no, she's gonna go throw water balloons at Morty apparently. Wang! Plurbs owie bibs! Work! Oh, Faye might be the only person in the household who gets along with the Tanamir. I'm pretty sure his hand just hates everybody else. Uh, Kenick's the closest thing he has to a friend here. <laughs> and he's on bad terms with a lot of people, especially Esther. That's really bad. 
Morty! Morty, take it easy! Mm. Apparently Morty thinks Sage is hot now. Atanamir lost his job. I'm not exactly sure what he was doing. I was paying attention to something else. So now he is just loafing around the house. He's doing whatever he wants. The only other person here is Morty. Now he's actually reading instead of watching TV. Yes, Sage. What are you reading? A magnetic attraction. Yeah, accurate. Wait, what? Random alien just came to our lot. Oh, holy crap. That's really weird. Anzith, what are you doing? You're sleeping in Morty's bed again. Oh. Graphics, what are you doing? No, she wants to sleep in Morty's bed. She's not even... Her room is gathering dust. I don't know what to do with you. Gwen's gonna play with the creepy pink thing. It desperately needs attention. If you talk to it. Uh, talk to it. Okay. I guess this is supposed to be like a Neopet thing. Jimana Jimangok? Javi Jubazo. Oh, Gwen can cheer it up. 